Hello everyone. So <clears throat> today <clears throat> I want to talk to you. I want to encourage you. Today I want to give you some tips on how to accomplish your 2014 goals. Now, I know every year, many people at the beginning of the year, they write down their goals, they write down their <clears throat> New Year's resolutions, and then, you know, by mid-January, at the latest, by the end of January, they have abandoned those goals. So today, I just want to give you a few tips about how to accomplish the goals that you have written down this year in my book in my records will be one of my best years so what is going to make this year different what is going to make this diff this year different than any other year well here are a few tips for you tip number one of course, you have to write down your goals. You have to have them written somewhere. That's goal 101. You have to have them written down somewhere, okay? So once you have them written down, make sure that you're able to, re to review them on a consistent basis. I would say daily, if not daily, then every other day, okay? You need to keep them in front of you because like the old saying says, out of sight, out of mind okay now my first tip is is you're gonna need to stay extremely focused on what it is that you really want to accomplish ask yourself am I passionate about these goals or is this just something I'm writing down I mean is my heart and soul into accomplishing what I have written down Okay, that's going to be critical because if there's no passion, then you will eventually abandon that goal. Okay, so step number one, again, is you're going to need to stay extremely focused. You're going to need to key in on that. I would say don't get carried away. Um, you know, take three things, big things that potentially you want to, um, you know, three goals that you want to accomplish in 2014. Now, if you are more advanced, then of course you can have more. Like myself, I have goals for my marriage. I have goals for ministry. I have goals for my blog. I have goals for my YouTube channel. So, you know, that's advanced when you have goals in all these different areas. But if you are just starting out, just take three things, three things that you would like to accomplish in the year 2014, okay? Focus in on those things, okay? Tip number two, become dogmatic about your goals, okay? Take responsibility for your goals. You know, we like to sometimes accuse, you know, other people of why we didn't achieve our goals. You know, I didn't lose weight because my husband is always taking me out to Red Lobster. No, you don't have to eat Red Lobster. You choose to eat Red Lobster. Take full responsibility for your goals, okay? Own those goals. You cannot blame anybody else for you not accomplishing your goals okay so number two is have a again is have a dogmatic attitude seriously uh there there's going to be negativity that come your way there's going to be doubt that come your way way there's going to be people that saying you can't accomplish that you know forget them get your mindset that you're going to accomplish this no matter what if you're trying to apply for a house and say you have, they say, hey, your credit wasn't good enough. Hey, what does that mean? I'm still going to do what's necessary. I'm going to get this house by the end of 2014. I don't care what is necessary to do it. Don't listen to the naysayers. Stay focused. Get dogmatic. Seriously. I mean, you ought to get an attitude if anything negative come your way when it, when it has to do with you when it has to do with, with you preve preventing you from reaching your goals, okay? Number three is 
under no circumstances, under no circumstances, give up, okay? Okay, this is the 15th, the 16th of the month, okay? If you said you was going to start on the diet in January 1 and you have already eaten some Pringles and, you know, you've already had some cake, so what? Put that cake aside. Tomorrow, start again. Do not give up. You still have 300 something plus days to make this thing right. You still have 300 something days to accomplish your goal. Do not give up. I don't care what happens. I don't care if you, you know, slip up. Do not give up. Stay absolutely determined. Okay. Tip number four. Excuses, excuses are not going to be acceptable. Okay. No excuses. No, you know, no excuses are going to be acceptable. You know, if you want to, you know, lose weight, do it, do it. You know, just no excuses are going to be acceptable. Absolutely none, none, none. Refuse to make excuses. Refuse to hear it excuses just only think about that goal in front of you what you're going to feel like uh you know what when you accomplish that goal the outcome okay focus on the outcome of when you actually obtain that goal okay and then the final tip is stop talking about what you want to do and just do it you know the nike uh the nike motto is just do it a lot of times we talk about what we want to do we write lists down about what we want to do and we tell so and so and we tell this person and that person what we want to do but ultimately we haven't taken any actions toward that goal so i encourage you to do something don't just talk about it today is the 16th of the month if you have written down any goals for January uh, for the new year, you should have started some kind of way. You should have talked to somebody. You should have called somebody. You should have connected with somebody. You should have taken some kind of action towards that goal because every action that you take is bringing you closer and closer to that goal. Okay. So yes, I'm going to be adding a segment uh, to my channel that will just be inspirational pieces, motivational pieces, helping you to obtain or reach your goals. I'm feeling very passionate about goal setting this year because I have so much in front of me and I'm basically determined not to let no one stop me from going to where I have to be. You understand what I'm saying? So listen. We can do this. Another reason why I decided to do this type of video is because this helps me be accountable, okay? A lot of times we can't accomplish our goals because we haven't, we're not accountable to anybody. We haven't partnered with anybody to help encourage us, to help walk us through to the end, okay? So this is my way of holding myself accountable. That way I can go back and review the videos to figure out where I was or where I missed it or to get my own personal motivation. And hopefully these videos will motivate you as well. So please, I really want your feedback. Please like this video, make a comment below and let me know if you're interested in this type of segment. I'm, you know, I'm doing this segment anyway, but I would like to know if you're interested in this, uh, leave a comment below. Also, if you have, you know, you know, at least one major goal that you would, would like to accomplish in uh, this year, please leave it down below. That way, when I'm doing these videos, I can refer to different people's goals and you know basically do a goal checkup that's what i think i may call the segment um goal checkup like how, how are you doing this is february okay this is march how are you doing in reference to your goal three months later four months later five months later because oftentimes when we set that we write that goal down we put it in a notebook and seven months later we are literally wiping dust 
off of that notebook trying to figure out what we wrote down many months ago. So that is going to be it for this video and I have just one question for you. Just one, one question. Who, who, I ask you, who is going to stop you from creating the life you want? Who is going to stop you from obtaining the goals that you have for yourself? The answer is simple. Nobody but you. Go ahead. Take action. Do something. All right, you guys, I will chat with you guys later. Bye-bye.